Hey guys, it's Kylie, and today I'm going to be showing you the creative process behind my makeup and reels. Honestly, it's just a lot of chaos and repeating the same actions over and over and over from start to finish. And right now, what I'm doing is rehearsing the lines that I'm going to try to say for the lip syncing audio that I'm using. This is probably one of the hardest parts because sometimes audios are really hard to understand and I don't like lip syncing wrong. So I have done and will redo these takes tons of times until I get it just right. And even if I think that I recorded a good take, I will continue to record at least one or two or possibly three more and then compare all of them and see which one is actually the best. And of course, the longer that I spend trying to record a single clip, the more I feel like things are just not quite right. So I unintentionally start to spend a lot of time adjusting very minuscule things that really only make a difference to me. I think about that quite often that I'm so nitpicky with my videos, but I know when I post them, like the only person who would have even noticed is me. So sometimes I need to just relax with it, but that's easier said than done. Now on a side note, I would like to add that this is the first kind of BTS video that I've ever done, so your feedback would be greatly appreciated as to what you think of this and how I edited it. Uh, saying edited always throws me off because I feel like it doesn't sound right, but there's not actually another way to say it, but you get the idea. So if you would leave a comment with your thoughts, I would love to hear what you have to say. I know that sometimes uh, content creators can make the videos look really easy to do, but there is a lot that goes on behind the scenes. There's a lot of time and effort that goes into it, a lot of editing. Obviously, I am just showing you guys what I am doing action-wise, but I'm not showing you all the editing that I do on my screen in Instagram and things like that. Now that I am all done with those lip syncing audios, it is time for the fun part, which is doing my hair and makeup. I will also be recording a reel as I'm doing my makeup, and those are some of my favorite ones to do. Just doing a nice long reel with a lot of transitions as I'm doing my makeup. I love them so much. And I have noticed that they are some of my least performing videos on Instagram. Um, and that's largely due to retention because the longer a video is, the person has to be really invested to continue watching it. And if you don't capture their attention in the first, I think it's like the first two to three seconds, um, then after that, they're more likely to swipe away, which is usually the problem that I have. However, I enjoy doing these videos so much and I do them for myself, so I don't really mind. But I have noticed that my transition reels that are shorter and are average about five seconds long, they have the best retention. So that kind of just proves the point but again, I do this for fun, I do it for me, and if someone wants to stick around watching my videos to see the end result, then I'm glad that they did. Some people are too impatient to wait for the full transition, and that's okay. But I personally love the longer videos, and I will continue doing them to my favorite songs. Mm. 
Now, unfortunately, I do a lot of this too, which is literally just sitting and thinking about what I'm going to do next and what kind of transitions I want to use, how they're going to flow together. I literally waste so much time <laughs> zoning out and thinking. It's ridiculous. But eventually an idea will come to me and then I can continue moving forward. I just hope that it doesn't take me too terribly long because this entire process, it's really like borderline a whole day affair. Now that my makeup's been removed, it is time to start my makeup transformation videos and the first one that I'm working on was just going to be a very simple like one transition and done however I was just not liking how any of the clips came out I was trying to do an updated version from a video that I had done probably about a year ago at this point And none of the takes that I had were really living up to my expectations. So I ended up just trashing it and moving on to the next thing that I had wanted to do.
Okay, don't mind the sudden jump in clips. I started running really behind and I just shut off the camera and finished doing my makeup and everything else um, afterwards. And now I am just resuming what I was doing with finishing up that transition video that I was working on. So sometimes when I'm making multiple transition videos, I try to change my makeup at least a little bit to some degree, uh, depending on how many videos I'm making, just so there's some variation. Uh, I personally don't like having too many of the same looking videos and cover photos on my Instagram profile. So that's all I did here. I just changed some of my makeup a little bit and I'm going to finish the rest of the transition videos that I started and then take some pictures afterwards. And that about wraps this up. I would love if you would give the video a thumbs up and leave a comment with your thoughts on it. I also post a new video every week in addition to daily shorts, so you can subscribe to so you can subscribe to see all of those when they come out. I hope you enjoyed today's video and I will see you next time. Now I feel like a